Get ready. Thought we were in trouble there for a second, but it's fine. We're fine. Oh. Ah! Hey fellow Star Wars fans, I'm John Hoey from Star Wars Newsnet and the Resistance Broadcast. Uh, Just wanted to send this message out there about Make Solo 2 Happen Day 2020, which is going to happen on Monday, May 25th, and just want to kind of give a rundown of what it's all about and how you can take part if you love Solo and you'd like to see more adventures of Han and Chewie and the other characters from the movie. Uh, in a movie or a Disney Plus series. So basically how it goes is this. On Monday, May 25th, all day on your social media accounts, whether that's Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, just simply use the hashtag MakeSolo2Happen. And you can post photos of you wearing MakeSolo2Happen shirts, any solo shirt, a Chewy shirt. Chewy's here with me right now. Um, a short video of why you'd like to see more Solo. Basically, anything you could think of to celebrate Solo a Star Wars story, uh, your love for that movie, and your hopes to see those adventures continue. Again, with Han, Chewie, and all the characters, Enfys, Nest, Maul, Kira, all down the line. Um, so it's, it's going to be a great day. We're really looking forward to putting that together for you. And uh, keep an eye out for uh, more details as the week goes on. We're going to be announcing a giveaway later this week uh, for a contest that you can take part in. So tell your family, your friends, your coworkers, neighbors, whoever likes Star Wars in your life. Uh, and if you're down with some cool positive fan movements, this is a good one here. Um, Make Solo 2 Happen Day. Again, May 25th, next Monday. I just kind of wanted to tell you where this thing came about. So back in 2018, after Solo came out, immediately when I left the theater, I was like, wow, they left that off for a perfect sequel. Han and Chewie go into Jabba's palace to start working for Jabba and sort of fill in those stories of how he was working with him and getting into trouble and his issues with Boba Fett, uh, maybe some more entanglements with Lando. A lot of stuff could be told. And of course, the other stuff, you know, Crimson Dawn with Kira and Maul, Enfys Nest and the start of the rebellion. A lot of things were left open to tell more stories. Unfortunately, the movie didn't do that well at the box office because honestly, it wasn't marketed very well. Denny's? I think that was it? I think marketing at a dollar store promoting items for $2 would have better marketing than Solo a Star Wars Story did. So long story short, later that year, around the time of the release for the Blu-ray, I went to James Bainey, my co-host on the Resistance broadcast, and said, wouldn't it be funny if we made a t-shirt that said, make Solo 2 happen? So instead of saying star and wars around Solo, it said make and happen with the two at the end. And just kind of being tongue-in-cheek about it because it was so unlikely for them to make a sequel because of how the movie performs at the box office. So we thought it was a good idea to kind of put our stamp on that and be like the Solo 2 people and make Solo 2 happen and all that. And I didn't really think it was going to take off, but for the first time since the original Star Wars movie, I felt a Star Wars movie was an underdog and needed someone to root for it. And that kind of feeling is what manifested this into what it became. And I wore this shirt at New York Comic Con in 2018, and a lot of people came up to me or gave me high fives and were really into the idea. Like, yes, I love Solo. Solo was awesome. I can't believe more people didn't see it or I didn't see it in the theaters because uh, I didn't want to go see it or I didn't know when it was coming out or I heard it wasn't good. But then I saw it and I loved it. A lot of that all throughout the day at New York Comic Con. And it made me thinking like, wow, people are really into this thing. Flash forward to Star Wars Celebration, we wore our shirts, me, James, and Lacey, a lot of people were into that, and all of a sudden, some of the people involved with Solo started getting involved in loving the idea, from Jonas Sotomo, who even said his baby's first words were Make Solo 2 Happen when we gave him a t-shirt, um, and uh, Rob Brito, the producer, uh, Aaron Kel- Kellyman, who played Emphis Nest, uh, Brian Herring, uh, the puppeteer, uh, Matthew Wood, all people, in, Ron Howard, Ron Howard, the director, quote tweeted it. John Kasdan said he had more stories to tell. Uh, so a lot of people started getting involved in it. And we did Make Solo 2 Happen Day last year on May 23rd, and it went trending internationally. Uh, I think one of the top three topics in the world, and I believe at one point uh, close to around number one in the United States, and it surpassed our, our wildest uh, imaginations. And the best part about it was, It was a positive day and a positive movement for fans, and Star Wars needs that uh, more than ever. So we're doing it again on May 25th. Um, We hope you can get involved. And again, the only thing you have to do is post using hashtag MakeSolo2Happen. That's pretty much it. So Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, wherever you are, 
Just have at it. And we're going to celebrate later that night by bringing back our virtual cantina, which is like a Zoom call with a lot of fellow fans. Uh, we're going to have a live stream uh, from the Star Wars News Net YouTube channel that you can also take part in and watch and comment and that sort of thing. So uh, hopefully you can get involved with that. But basically the bottom line is I love Solo so much uh, from day one. And I really hope that they are willing to e at least explore making a follow-up to that with Han and Chewie and uh, a bunch of all the other characters because it really left off in a great spot and it would make an unbelievable Disney Plus series. Imagine seeing Han and Chewie roll up to Jabba's palace right after the, uh, the end uh, of Solo. So um, that's pretty much the gist that makes Solo 2 happen. We really hope you guys get involved. Spread the word. Tell your friends. Let's make it a great day this coming Monday, May 25th. And uh, let's just have a lot of fun with it, celebrating Star Wars, doing what Star Wars fans do best, which is having a good time and sharing our shared love of this franchise and especially Solo with each other. So I uh, hope to see you guys out there. Hashtag make Solo 2 happen. Thanks.